For this adventure, I headed back to San Onofre, but the state beach had a line to get in, so I headed down to the trails, which is something I haven't done since I was a kid. I couldn't really remember if the break was good there or not, but we decided to try it out anyway. Here's the scenic walk down to the beach, taking in the beautiful sunset. The waves here, they're not quite as consistent as the state beach. It took a little bit of getting used to and figuring out the spot. Spend a little time taking it easy, taking it cautious. Kind of taking a while to get to your feet. But once I was up, I realized it was just a nice gentle wave. At that point, you just give a shaka to the sun and take off on your next wave and try to tear it up. Celebrate the wave with a nice little victory plop of disbelief. Paddle back out and try to catch another one. Once that sun starts to get real low, you gotta catch one from the outside and try to take it all the way into shore. Which is quite a distance, almost equal to that of the state beach. As you can tell right here, I ride the whitewash for so long, I start looking for things to do. Not realizing the beautiful sky behind me. I'm pretty thankful, I didn't think I was going to get a chance to surf this evening with the line to get into the beach. But oftentimes, if you take the path less traveled, things tend to work out. And like always, every surf trip is an adventure.